Breaking, Shocking O.J. Simpson Announcement America in Disbelief Disgraced NFL star O.J. Simpson is set to go before a parole board tomorrow, and many legal experts predict that he would be released from prison. On Wednesday, a surprising announcement was made about Simpson's case that has many feeling outraged. CNN reported that those hoping that Simpson would be denied parole got bad news today when it was revealed that Bruce Fremont, the only surviving victim of the 2007 Simpson-led armed robbery that led to former football star's imprisonment, will testify before the board tomorrow in support of Simpson's release. I never thought that the crime deserved that much time, that long of a sentence. From untold reporters, referring to the 33 year sentence Simpson received in 2008. It's important that I see OJ face to face, man to man, he said. I'm going to tell the truth, the whole truth and nothing but the truth. Alfred Beardsley, the other victim of the robbery, died in 2015. However, the news today was not all good for Simpson. Daily Mail reported that Simpson may end up being denied parole because he was caught masturbating in his prison cell by a female corrections officer in June. Masturbation is strictly forbidden in federal prisons in the U.S. O.J. is facing a disciplinary hearing after being written up for masturbating in his prison cell said a prison source. He was caught by a female corrections officer making her normal rounds in late June. This means that when Simpson goes before the Nevada Department of Corrections Parole Board on Thursday, he still won't have faced a disciplinary hearing for the masturbation charge. The prison source said this could pose a problem for Simpson's bid for freedom. While it's not the most serious charge to be written up for in prison, it's serious enough that any potential parole date may be delayed or his parole denied altogether, added the source. Simpson has served nine years of the 33-year sentence he was given back in 2008 for kidnapping and robbery after he confronted a pair of memorabilia dealers with loads of OJ souvenirs at the Palace State Hotel and Casino on September 13, 2007. Of course, he is also known for going on trial for the 1994 murder of his ex-wife Nicole Simpson and her friend Ronald Goldman. Though he was found not guilty of their murders, many believe that Simpson committed the disturbing crime. 